Hi, this is Gary Woods, and welcome to Santa Barbara Real Estate Talk for Saturday, December 13th, 2014. This is analysis of the Santa Barbara Real Estate Market, including Carpenter Summerlin, Montecito, Hope Ranch, downtown Santa Barbara, and Goleta through the month of November 2014. For the home state PUD market, Numbers of sales fell from the previous month to about 70 in November, dropping from 87 in October and 109 in September. Median price, sales price also fell for the month to about 950 from 985 in October and 1.2 million in September. Open escrows also fell in November to about 80 from 107 in October and 81 in September, while the median list price on those escrows rose from 949 in October to approximately 1,049,000 in November. There were roughly 70 new listings that came on the market in November with a median list price of just about $1.5 million and an average list price of around $1.8 million, which left the overall inventory falling from 308 units for sale in October to about 290 in November. Year over year, sales are down about 17%, with the median sales price up about one to $1.14 million for approximately a 21% rise. Average sales price is also up, going from about $1.43 million in 2013 to approximately $1.73 million in 2014, also for a 21% rise, while the numbers of escrows are down with 1,161 and 13 to just over 1,014, with median list price on those escrows up about 20% to approximately $1.1 five million. Look at the district. Scarpia summer and sales are down from ninety nine to seventy nine, but the median sales price is up from eight fifty two five to nine and a quarter. Numbers of escrows are also down from 103 to 89, with the median list price on those escrows rising from 872 last year to 949.5 this year. For Montecito, sales are also down from 212 to 195, with the median sales price rising from 2.4 to 4 million to 2.75 million. Escrows are also down, going from 219 to 194, but the median list price on those escrows is up from 2.495 million to 2.91 million. East of State Street sales are down, going from 294 and 13 to 270 and 14, but the median sales price is up from 967.5 to 1.196 million. Escrows went down from 306 to 282, with the median list price on those escrows rising from 1 million dollars last year to about 1.2 million this year. West of State Street sales are down from 255 to 209, but the median sales price is up from 877 to 971. Numbers of escrows are down with 272 and 13 compared to 222 and 14, but the median list price on those escrows is up from 895 last year to 959 this year. Hope Ranch sales are up and the median sales price is also up from 2.056 million to 2.6 million. Numbers of escrows are up with 24 last year to 35 this year and the median list price on those escrows is up from 2.425 million to 13 to 3.175 million in 14. Lita South sales are down with 108 last year and 76 this year, but the median sales price is up from 730 to 750. Numbers of escrows are down from 94 to 75, with the median list price on those escrows rising from 710 to 749. We the North sales are down with 99 and 13 and 151 and 14, with the median sales price rising from 795 to 847. Numbers of escrows are down from 194 to 164, with the median list price on those escrows going up from 796.5 to 846.5. For condo segment of the market, sales fell to about 35 in November from 40 in October, but up from the 29 we saw in September. Median sales price also rose from 553.750 to uh, in October to about 760 in November, while the numbers of escrows rose from the 36 we saw in October to about 45 in November, with the median list price on those escrows remaining where it was in the previous month from 569 in October to 569 in November. There are about 45 new condo listings that came on the market for the month with a median list price of about 590, rising from 500,000 in October, and an average list price of approximately 760, equaling the October number, while the overall inventory rose in November from about 105 units for sale in October to approximately 110 in November. Look at the districts. Currently, this summer, and sales are down from 80 to 38, with the median sales price rising from 445 to 515. 
Numbers of escrows are also down from 75 last year to 47 this year, but the median list price on those escrows is up from 449.450 to 499. On a state of condo sales are down with 29 and 13 and 16 and 14, but the median sales price is up from 1.115 million to 1.6 million. Numbers of escrows are down with 29 and 13 and 19 and 14, while the median list price on those escrows is up from 1.245 million and 13 to 1.695 and 14. East of State Street sales are up from 90 to 93, with the median sales price rising from 563.5 to 640. Numbers of escrows are up, going from 87 to 95, with the median list price on those escrows also up from 580 last year to 639 this year. West of State Street sales are up from 101 to 110, with the median sales price rising from 530 to 650. Escrows went up from 104 to 120, with the median list price on those escrows going from 553.5 to. Well, the South sales are up from 66 to 92, with the median sales price up from 445 to 544 to 50. Numbers of escrows are also up from 70 and 13 and. 94 and 114, with the median list price on those escrows up from 449 last year to 549,950 this year. The North sales are up from 52 to 58, with the median sales price up from 419,5 to 455. Escrows are also up from 50 to 57, with the median list price on those escrows going from 425 to 449. To the beginning of November, sales of single-family homes are down about 17% from 13, while the median sales price for those homes is up about 21%. For condos, sales are down approximately 5%, with the median sales price up over 11%. Of the single-family homes that sold for for the month, roughly 10.4% of those sales were over the asking price, and for condos, that number was about 14.2%. But three of the five over-the-asking-price condo sales were in the hideaway. Average over-asking price for homes that sold over-the-asking price was about 8.7, but really it was one sale that was listed for $1.1 million and sold for $1.6. For condos, the percentage over-the-asking price was about 8.7, but again, most of those were the upgrades in the hideaway. On the other side of the coin, 14% of the homes had inventory experienced a price reduction in November, while 19% of the condos went down in price. We usually finish the year with a lot of single-family sales, and 2014 should be no exception. Also, the median sales price for homes, which was declined for the past four months, should come back up to roughly $1 million, finishing the year with about a $1.15 million annualized median sales price, up 20-plus percent over 2013. Condo sales are a little more confusing, however, with big numbers racked up by the hideaway in 401 Chapala Street. The overall condo market is soft, with prices dropping slightly. Well, that's it for Santa Barbara Real Estate Talk for Saturday, December 13th, 2014. I am Jerry Woods. And if you'd like to give me a call to the show, I can be reached at 805-729-0910. Thanks for listening.